I hope today you'll take some time to appreciate that wonderful and beautiful music. The wonderful music of the wonderful country of US of A, United States of America. Now, us Americans on this channel got some crap because we didn't upload on 4th of July. Well, unlike other countries where it's just one day of patriotism, every day is America Day. And so I am bringing you a very patriotic battle, and it's against Zohan, and just as, this is just evidence of how much U.S. of A rocks. So without further ado, we're going to start this battle. Since it's so, so, so patriotic, I'm going to lead off with a Braviary, and I wasn't sure if he's going to, you know, outspeed me, but I should have figured, but it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, I'll just you turn out to Slowbro. Why do I have a Slowbro on my team? Well, where I live, there are plenty of lakes and stuff like that. And you know, sometimes us Americans like to take a break from our hard and rigorous activities like working and shooting stuff and just owning guns. Just man, our, our weaponry is amazing. Just let you guys know. So you guys are probably wondering, why is this American staying in on this fair phone? Well, one thing that not a lot of people know is that Slowbro is amazing, and it takes shit for Ferrothorn. So, I am going to scald this Ferrothorn until I get that bird. Us Americans never give up. We never surrender. We just like to back out of things. But that's not surrendering. It's not surrender until you say the word. Finally, he does go for a power whip. And I go for a skull, but unfortunately I do not get the burn. So I am not retreating, I'm just backing out. Temporarily, I will be back. And why do I have a Congledur? That's because the US of A is very, very strong. We have the power. The power. And I'll go for a substitute, and I will show you that power in just a few minutes. Alright. Well, not a few minutes, I should say, a few seconds. And he is going to hit him with a punch of the U.S. of A. U.S.A. 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 And you folks are probably wondering, where are your other fellow Americans? Well, it's a little bit of, it's a little bit early, but I'm about to go to my American job working on an ice cream parlor and serving American people. So I thought I would do this real quick for you folks before I had to do that. And as you see, we're both are trying to, you know, calm our jets a little bit, take a little bit of a break. But... I make a hasty retreat and sacrifice my braviary, you know, we sacrifice everything for our freedom. Just to give you a heads up. But finally I send in Victini. Why Victini must you ask? Because I'm going to praise God for victory. And you folks are probably wondering, why would you go for a slash shock? I was predicting him to switch out. I didn't think he would stay in for a V-Crate. So the fortune uh, for me, I did waste our victory cry, but oh well. Sometimes us Americans have to make some sacrifices in my life. When I see that he's trying to set up some hazards, just like, mm mm mm, now I'm gonna bring in the drought. Right now, where I live, there's about 39 degrees Celsius every day. What is 39 degrees Celsius, I might ask? Well, that's alien talk for 100 over 100 degrees Fahrenheit. That's right. In America, we don't use Celsius, we use Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit is very strong. So I see that I want to scout out what he's going to do. I want to make the safe prediction. A very good prediction. Not a very good prediction, I should say. Not a prediction. A very good move into another Pokemon. So I need to sacrifice my victimy. And so he's just going to Earthquake for nothing. He's got nothing on Team America. Team America kicks ass every time. So he switches out to Theraform, which takes Ice Shard quite nicely. And why a Dawn fan? Don Fan, just another reason why we are so, so tough. And he is able to rapid spin away all the things that hurt America. Like, just, just a lot of things. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright. And here he goes for a power whip, does nothing to Ninetales. Ninetales brings out the drought, kills all the grass in here, kills everything, and just. I'm just gonna lure him out. And I'm not quite sure what he was thinking right here. He's saying his brain limb, but I'm just gonna go for a flamethrower, almost be able to take it out. And he is going to spore my nine tails. Doesn't matter. Nine tails doesn't stay asleep forever. I'll wake up one day. I don't care if you're gonna bulk up. Team America kicks ass. Let me tell you. So 
I'm gonna hit him with another flamethrower. Brain Loom is out of the way. I am a happy camper. I have not the advantage, but we're tied, but I will have the advantage soon. You just wait. And I don't care if he has Mold Breaker. <laughs> Fuck Mold Breaker. I am Team America, and Ninetales does not give a shit. Anyways, Slowbro is gonna come back out, be able to take that earthquake, kind of okay just because he gets a crit. Doesn't matter because Team America will get Team America will get your revenge. It's our, our revenge. Cannot talk today. That's because I've been working hard, expre expressing my patriotism every single day, and sometimes I just get so excited about being American. I just, just I cannot express the words properly. So he thinks he's gonna be a cool kid, go out to his tentacle. I know this, but I still go for toxic, just in case. Just in case, folks. So, out comes Conkledur. I am looking for this burn. I want to be burned. Why is that? Because even when kicked in the face, Team America fights back even harder. That's right. I am able to get up a sub, and now I'm going to kind of scout out what kind of damage I can do with payback. About 26-28% about each time. And I wasn't quite sure if the unresisted focus punch would be would do more damage than the neutral payback, but with stab it would do more. Plus it has more base power. So here I just wind my arm back and then I just punch I punch it right in the face. Punch everything that America doesn't send kind communism and all that stuff. Yes. I am freedom. I am punching for freedom, thank you very much. And he's thinking, oh, I can break a skull. You forgot, America's in a drought. There's fires in California and Pennsylvania. There's just fire everywhere. It's a fucking heat wave. You're not gonna break this cell with your little skulls. Hell no, we need more than that. We need rain. But Team America hasn't gotten rain in some time. But I am just gonna sit here with my conkleder. He thinks he can set up his Valkorona. He thinks he can beat me with Valkorona. I don't care. He misses, or he hits his first fire blast. The second one will miss, as you will see in a few moments. And I get the burn. So he's thinking, hey, what can I do right here? Oh. So I thought he was gonna kill me off with a fire blast, but he misses. Which I'm not quite sure why he would carry fire blast on a non sun team. But whatever. I'm gonna go for another focus or er, map focus punch. A mock punch as he thinks I can just set up in Team America's face. I will laugh in the face of their defeat. Well I was like he's gonna be greedy. And America's never greedy. America is proud. So as he goes for another quiver dance, I go for that big focus punch. And guess what? By Volcarona, that's what you get for being cocky to Team America. We will get our revenge one day. So in comes Haxorus, I bring out my Dawn Fan. This is a max defense, and not max defense, max attack Dawn Fan. So I am going to be able to do some damage. But he crits me again. You know what happens when Team America gets crit? We just bring out more stuff. And what are I mean by more stuff? I mean, well, first I get paralyzed, which is quite annoying, but that's okay. That's okay. Team America can handle it. And I am able to, you know, slack off, be able to relax a little bit, as I get prepared to punch him right in the face of victory. But apparently, he's gonna take Team America. He ran away, but thank you very much for the game, Zohan. If you guys appreciate this patriotic video, like, comment, subscribe, add to your favorites, you know, all that good stuff. It's a little bit long of a battle, actually. But that's okay. Just remember, every day is America Day. Stay classy, YouTube.